The international community has uncovered a very dangerous plot by George Weyer to win the next election by rigging it in order to remain in power, and he'll do it by any means necessary. With less than 600 soldiers in the entire national army, Weyer... That is a lie. The military have over 1,600 people. That's now only 600 soldiers they have in the country that have more than that. So right there is a lie. That's the first lie. Dangerous militia, filled with the worst criminals recruited from Boko Haram and Al-Qaeda. You see, like I told you, they are doing everything they can to make this man look bad. Okay, it's fine. You can make Judge Weah look bad. He's not my brother. He's not my father. But don't make the country to get into civil war. Because what he about to say, they are all nonsense. Someone paid this dude, and he doesn't really have no idea about Liberia, but he just wants to talk. So just listen to him. Listen to the white piece of, you know what. These mercenaries are fully armed and ready to destroy Ware's opposition. They've been well funded with the new missing money. Billions were printed. I ain't got nothing to do with your politics. But this video right here is strictly lie. So if you call Boko Haram, if you call Al Qaeda, they're in a way, it will evolve the international community like America and other places. The new missing money. Billions were printed and stolen over the last couple of years. This includes the eight billions printed earlier this year in 2022 alone. This terrorist group is made up of foreigners from Jamaica, Burkina Faso, Middle East and Nigeria. Locally, they've also recruited and trained ATU rebels from former warlord Taylor through Monrovia's city mayor, Jefferson Kugi. Oh, oh, someone is running that campaign. I see. Oh, now I understand now. I, understand. I hope you understand that too. Because first of all, we call Nigeria. They have Boko Haram in Nigeria. We call uh, Jefferson Kochi. People don't like him already. Most people don't like him. Uh, they call ATU, Chancellor, former uh, body guys and stuff. So everything that the Liberian people don't like, that's exactly what they're going to call. Watch this video and see. It doesn't make sense to me. And I know at the end of this video, you will understand that they are lying. Someone paid this white dude. And this white dude doesn't even know nothing about Liberia. So that's why he's all over the place. You know, you don't like Josh Weah. You don't like Kwame. You don't like uh, Kwame's. Uh, how to call it, Black Eye, uh, Ben Ayure, uh, who else? All those people, all those politicians, if you don't like that, I don't care. They are not my relatives, but don't put Liberia into a chaos again. Damn it. Unfortunately for the Grand Gideon. Man, you call my people Grand Gideons again, I will both slap you and Grand Gideons, not Grand Gideons. The person that showed you, they, they didn't teach you how to pronounce Grand Gideons. Grand Gideon, say that again one more time. Say that again. You see. Their county is being used as a training base without their citizens' knowledge. At the time of this report, there have been many sightings and ongoing pleas for help, but the government has refused to help. Investigators confirm the militia are currently using Doe's compound in Zwei Drew. That building doesn't even have no roof, it's all leaking in there. How many people, we, according to him, we have 600 soldiers. So how many people are using door compound to do this stuff? How many people fit in our place? Yeah, just, just listen to the video and know this guy is lying. Do not put the Liberian people together. If you want to run your politics, go and do it. But don't do what you're doing. I, I can pay the white dude too and get him money so he can talk. In fact, this dude I'm talking, we don't even know his radio station. We don't know his television station. There's no name of any kind of wish of the media company he's representing. That's sure right there. That's a lie. I'm not here to support anybody. I'm not here to support Josh Weir. But this video doesn't make no sense. Keep watching. I'm going to call my people Grand Gideon again one more time. Stupid. ...for secret meetings and storing large weaponry without the family's knowledge. Sources claim Weir is trying to purchase Doe's property through a secret party. Furthermore, Weir is behind the large number of citizens from Nimba moving into Grand Gide. My people, he just said it again. Grand Gide, uh, mm. And numerous corruption scandals, such as the disappearance of Alfred Dunner, a magistrate from the elections department who refused to participate in rigging elections. There are three things I want you to pay attention to. First of all, he said that George Weir is paying the Nimadian, the Gio and the Manu, to go to Grand Gide to destabilize, to revenge, how, how he come up with all this stuff? Somebody either from Grand G that counted, or somebody either from Lima, or somebody that is supporting the opposition is doing this. Because now, the Crown people and the Gyo people, the minor people, they don't get along. So yes, 
the Gyo people are going to Grand Jiria to kill people to, to revenge. You hear that? You hear what he just said? You hear that? Second more, uh, Kai Fale and uh, Zopeno, I've been hearing about them that, oh, they're killing people in Liberia. They killed this one Nima guy, the police officer. That's what, that's what I heard. I don't know if it's true or if it's not true. I'm not here to say it's not true or it's true because I wasn't there. They say again, he, uh, the, the other guy disappeared. Yeah, but that, that don't make sense to How can a big man like that disappear? Somebody did that to him. Somebody killed that people's son. But I don't have no proof of who did it. But according to sources, they say that uh, Kai Fari and uh, Zopen hand in it. So you see, so somebody have this those information and they pass it over passing it over to the white dude and this white dude is doing this anybody can go and pay anybody i can go and pay anybody right and say i want you to report on this just read this and the person will read it and i take all that media stuff and put it behind it just like a professional setting and stuff this and other people like our like brand people will believe what they're saying so i just want you to watch the video to the end what they're trying to do is to put people together now they're talking about gear people minor people and crime people revenge all the time we fight, we fought each other and kill each other. You're still coming up with this nonsense. The crown people are not gay people enemy. The gay people and the modern people are not crown people enemy. So you stop doing this nonsense. We will not fight each other no more. So if you want to run your politics, you'll run it different way. But some of us that don't talk into your politics, we will always talk when we see you guys trying to bring stupidity to our people. Because some people that will not understand, they will start hitting gay and modern. Modern people will start hitting crown people. Yeah, me. They report directly to disgraced Nathaniel McGill, who's been linked to secret killings, now blacklisted by the US for corruption. Weyer's plan is twofold. First, burn down Doe's compound to destroy any trace, then eliminate citizens of Grand Gideon. Yeah, he's still saying Gideon. I don't know what to say about this dude, but I will find you. I will find you. Let me tell you. Okay? All right, listen to this. Or listen to this, what he just said. Josh, we are trying to purchase this property through some of the relatives, okay? Because he wants to buy. All of a sudden, now he wants to burn down this property so that he can hide evidence. There's no, there's nothing to burn. The house is already gutted out. There's nothing there. There's no roof. There's no window. Nothing is leaking through that building. So what is there to burn? What is there? See, you're, you're, you're paying attention to this guy, man. This guy is not making sense at all. Whosoever person told this guy to do this, next time you're telling him, sit down and get him the rightful information. Don't just throw things at him. He's confused. You can't even see how he's reading. He's confused. He's reading from a paper. Thus allowing the Burkina Bees to take over the county and fulfilling Weyer's agreed plan with Sir Leaf. Similarly to the destruction, the Burkina Bees caused in Ivory Coast. Next stop for this militia is Monrovia. Again, they're being fully funded and well taken care of with the new money, which never made it into circulation. This money was kept as Weyer's personal stash to pay his illegal army and illicit activities, such as flying in prostitutes from India and supporting his reggae music career. Finally, sources have confirmed that Weyer is building a protected facility on Broad Street to secure the money outside of the banking system. We will continue to bring you updates on Weyer's secret plans. Our prayers are with the citizens of Liberia. God save Liberia. God save Liberia. You know about Liberia. You love Liberia. That's my first time seeing you on TV, on YouTube, talking about God save Liberia. You know about Liberia. You're trying to start confusion between us. Talking about Kai Fari and Zopenum. They're training people to betray their own country, to betray their own county. Do you know what you're trying to cause in there? So Penu and Kai Fali, they got family. Other people have family. Do you know what you're trying to cause in Grand Gideon? Do you know what you're trying to cause between the Grand Gideons? And like you call it Grand Gideons. Between your Grand Gideons and the Nimadian? Huh? It's the person that pay you, they didn't do a good job. So let them pay you again. I ain't here to support nobody, like I said. My people, you don't be paying attention to these kind of things. You're going to be seeing more videos from this channel. There's no proof of what he's saying. He didn't even put his uh, uh his his, his uh, TV station name there. Like people would say, Spoon TV, Spoon FM, Liberian TV, Totem TV, nothing. That he had himself. Y'all don't pay attention to the piece of crap, okay? White boy, go look for food and eat. 
White boy go find another job. Stop putting my people together. The day you go visit like bro will catch that one brush to be a bug good. ...to destabilize the county and plot their revenge. Ringleaders in this evil plot are Zhu Penyu and Kai Farley, who've been paid millions to betray their county and people. Both Penyu and Farley have been at the very core of election rigging. What kind of white boy here? So Penyu? Why you call Penyu? So Penyu? Not so Penyu? Damn! So Penyu. <laughs> First of all, he said that Josh Weir is paying the Nimarian, the Gyo and the Manu, to go to Grand Jire to destabilize, to revenge. How, how he come up with all this stuff? Somebody either from Grand Jire County, or somebody either from Lima, or somebody that is supporting the opposition is doing this. Because now, the Crown people and the Gyo people, the Manu people, they don't get along. So yes, the Gyo people are going to Grand Jire to kill people, to, to revenge. You hear that? You hear what he just said? You hear that? Second more, uh, Kai Fale and uh, Zopenu, I've been hearing about them that, oh, they're killing people in Liberia. They killed this one Nima guy, the police officer. That's what, that's what I heard. I don't know if it's true or if it's not true. I'm not here to say it's not true or it's true because I wasn't there. They say again, he, uh, the, the other guy disappeared. Yeah, but that, that don't make sense to How can a big man like that disappear? Somebody did that to him. Somebody killed that people's son. But I don't have no proof of who did it. But according to sources, they say that uh, Kai Fari and uh, Zopen hand in it. So you see, so somebody have this those information and they pass it over, passing it over to the white dude. And this white dude is doing this. Anybody can go and pay anybody. I can go and pay anybody right now and say, I want you to report on this. Just read this. And the person will read it. And I take all that media stuff and put it behind it, just like a professional setting and stuff. This and other people, like our librarian people, will believe what they're saying. So I just want you to watch the video to the end. What they're trying to do is to put people together. Now they're talking about gear people, minor people, and crime people, revenge. All the time we fight, we fought each other and kill each other. You're still coming up with this nonsense. The crown people are not gear people enemy. The gear people and the modern people are not crown people enemy. So you yeah, stop doing this nonsense. We will not fight each other no more. So if you want to run your politics, you'll run it different way. But some of us that don't talk into your politics, we will always talk when we see you guys trying to bring stupidity to our people. Because some people that will not understand, they will start hitting gear and modern. Modern people will start hitting crown people. Yeah, I me. Mean.